Hi everybody, Ms. Lee here. We're going to go ahead and go over uh, question six uh, from the unit eight progress check part A. So the question states, if the average value of the function f on the interval from two to six is three, what is the value of the integral from two to six of five times f of x plus two uh, dx, okay? So this is what we want to evaluate. And what they told us is that the average value, uh, average value from two to six, is three, okay? So if you were to write this as an expression, what you would say is average value means integral over interval. So the integral of f of x dx from two to six equals three. Uh, so that's the integral over interval, sorry. So integral over the interval, so six, minus two, so this should equal three. Okay, so just to simplify this a little bit, uh, what you can see is that we have the integral from two to six of f of x uh, dx over four should equal three. So if you multiply both sides by four, you know that this integral equals 12. So if you have the integral from two to six of f of x uh, dx, that should equal 12. Okay, and so reading the question, it's asking you to evaluate uh, the value of the integral from 2 to 6 of 5 times f of x plus 2 dx. And so based on the properties of integrals, you can actually like split this up and then fill in where that 12 is. Okay, so we do uh, the integral from 2 to 6 of 5 times f of x dx plus the integral from 2 to 6 of 2 uh, dx. And so if you're looking at that, what that means is uh, we can split the integral across uh, addition. Okay, so you knew that before. So we split the integral across addition. And now we have a constant here. And y'all also know that we can factor this constant out of the integral. So we have five times the integral from two to six of f of x dx plus the integral from two to six of two uh, dx. Okay. So based on what we found earlier, y'all should know that the integral from two to six f of x dx equals 12. So this right here should equal 12. So we have 5 times 12 plus, and then we find the integral uh, of 2, which is 2x, and we evaluate that from 2 to 6, and then we plug in 6 and 2. So we have 5 times 12, that's 60, plus, and then we plug in 6, it's 12, minus, and then we plug in two and we get four. And so your answer would be 68, 68. Okay. And if you're looking at the answer choices on this uh, slide, you'll see, or on the question, it says that uh, answer choice D is your answer. So D is your answer. Happy day.